Two and a half years passed from the time Sasuke left the Hidden Leaf. Naruto grew stronger as Jiraiya's pupil, and Sakura studied medical ninjutsu under Tsunade. Now full-fledged ninja, they joined forces with Kakashi, their former captain. Kakashi announced that he would test their abilities by having them undergo the same trials as in the past. Well, same rules as three years ago. Just take these bells from me. Of course, if you don't come at me aggressively, you'll never get the bells. We'll show Kakashi-sensei exactly what we're made of. Yep, we'll show him what the training did. Now then. Let's begin. Yeah! Yes! I guess... I'll have to be tougher on you. I'll finish this in one shot! There's no way we can lose! Here I come! I got a feeling I'm gonna have to take these guys more seriously this time. Check this out! <laughs> Pretty impressive. <laughs> You've gotten stronger too, Sakura. Have you leaving me behind, Naruto? Better back off. <laughs> Is that all, Kakashi Sensei? Not bad. Fire style! Fireball Jutsu! That's huge! Now! Ow, ow, ow. Here goes! Big secret finger jutsu! Thousand years of death! All right! Huh? Phew. That was too close. Right on, Kak... You're doing well. But, can you do it again? I'm totally gonna get those bells! Calm down. It's okay. <laughs> I can do this! Wow. You've become quite the ninja. <laughs> Water style, water dragon jutsu! Lightning blade! Dodge this! Watch! Lightning blade! You'll have to do better! How's this? Water Dragon Jutsu! Lightning Blade! <laughs> Fire Style! Fireball Jutsu! <laughs> that is pretty shocking, right? Water Style! Water Dragon Jutsu! Gotta get out of this! I haven't lost yet. Water style, water dragon jutsu! Sakura! Leave it to me! Damn it! Nice work, Sakura! How's this? Water dragon jutsu! Gotta stop messing around! You guys are. Water style, water dragon jutsu! 
Sandra! Uh, Naruto! Huh? Ah! Ah! Shadow Clone Jutsu! They've really grown. <laughs> I didn't think you'd manage to take great, the bells. Sakura. You too. <laughs> All right. Maybe I'm even stronger than you now, Kakashi. Stop acting so conceited. Anyway, you both passed the test, and you'll be going on the next mission with me. They thereby demonstrated to Kakashi that they were no longer students, but rather qualified shinobi worthy of trust. And with that, Team Kakashi was formed. Just then, Naruto suddenly received some unexpected news. Gara, who once competed ruthlessly at the Chunin exam and now served as the Kazakage, had been abducted by a member of the Akatsuki. The Akatsuki had a plan to extract the tailed beasts from the Jinchuriki, such as Naruto and Gara, to use them for their own nefarious purposes. To rescue Gara, Naruto and his friends attacked an Akatsuki hideout. There, Naruto found Deidara, who had abducted Gara, along with Gara's lifeless body, which had had Shikaku ripped from it. 
Naruto chased after Deidara, and they engaged in battle in the forest. Understanding the agony Gara must have endured, Naruto erupted in a violent rage against the barbaric Akatsuki. Give me back Gara! <laughs> Bring it if you can. You. I can never forgive you! You're a strange thing, Shuriki. It's no use. Your Scarlet character is no less strange. I've never seen a Jin Shuriki as beloved as he is. Hmm. You can't forsake one of your own kind, can you? You feel connected to this pathetic creature. Don't you mess you up <laughs> Bring it if you can. <laughs> Not too bad. I'm gonna win! You can't no bite. With the help of friends, he drove Deidara off and recovered Gara's body. There was no one, however, who could bring him back from death. Why Gara? Why is it always him? Calm down, Naruto Uzumaki. Shut up! If you say a ninja hadn't put that monster in Gara, none of this would have happened! Did you ever consider what Gara thought? Did you ever even ask? You call him a Jinchuriki? Who are you to decide that fate for someone else? Naruto wailed in grief. Moved by this display, Granny Chio, a prominent figure in the hidden sand, gave her own life to bring Gara back from the dead. She did this because of her faith in the ability of the young to change the future. Naruto. Lady Chio entrusted the future to you and Gara. It was a death befitting a ninja. Yeah, same as the old man, the third Hokage. Recalling that the third Hokage had held the same sentiments, Naruto resolved to carry that hope forward.
With the information regarding Orochimaru that he had obtained during his fight with the Akatsuki, he set out for their hideout with his friends and Sai, a new member of Team Kakashi. There, Naruto was met by Sasuke, who had developed at an alarming rate under Orochimaru's training. For the first time since their clash in the final valley, the former teammates were reunited. Sasuke, I found you! I'm sick of you showing up all the time. Now I'll just cut you off completely. I'm taking you home, no matter what! <laughs> you won't be able to put a scratch on me. I'll bring Sasuke back at any cost! This connection you share with Naruto and his friends, I want to see it for myself. Connection? You're as slow as ever, I see. I'm right here. There's nothing more foolish than being tied down by others. Having too many ties in this world only leads you astray. It weakens your ambitions. If I have any connection at all, it's not with you people. My only connection is one of hatred towards my brother. Are you that eager to piss me off? Don't he Oh no! Multi Shadow Pose Jutsu! Why can't you understand? Sasuke! <laughs> what happened to you? I have my own path to follow. Stay out of my way. Orochimaru wants you as his vessel. <laughs> Doesn't matter. As long as I achieve my goal. That's enough. I'll protect our connection no matter what it takes! Oh, yeah? Then all I have to do is cut it off. <laughs> Not bad. I'm right here. Playtime's over. I'll finish you here once and for all. Enough talk. What? Did that wake you up? You're still a child. Naruto! Fire style! Fireball Jutsu!
Sasuke! Sasuke! Without so much as a nod in Naruto and Sakura's direction, Sasuke left with Orochimaru. Sasuke! I couldn't stop him again. I... I'm weak. So that's the extent of your bond. No, it isn't. In that case, everything's fine. You can still bring Sasuke back. Sai. Thanks. For real. Lamenting his inability to stop them, Naruto vowed to become stronger. With painful memories of his failure at Orochimaru's hideout, he decided to train under Kakashi. At that same time, the Akatsuki's movements intensified, targeting Jinchuriki in various lands. Receiving reports that Akatsuki members had invaded the Land of Fire, the Hidden Leaf dispatched a strike team to stop their rampage. However, the team struggled in its fight against the all-but-immortal member of the Akatsuki, known as Kakazu. Having just completed training, Naruto rushed to their aid. Naruto Uzumaki. I didn't think you'd come for me. <laughs> You saved me some time. I'll get you! You alone? I think you're underestimating me. But now I can easily watch you. 
so it actually works out well. I'll take you out with my jutsu! No matter how powerful your jutsu, it can't be my experience. This can't be! You'll never stop me! How dare you! How did I lose to such an opponent? Wing style, Rasen shoot again. Hit it. And so, Naruto bested a mighty foe who had once been considered unbeatable. Seeing this, Kakashi could see that the youth were ushering in the winds of change. Naruto has become strong, truly strong. He's practically surpassed me. Can you sense it? You're always in his mind, inspiring him. You make him strong. You do know that. Don't you, Sasuke? <laughs> 